Hey everybody, it's Aaron from the Kilby Life. We're doing an adventure over here. I got Levi and Jacob. They're turning 10 in like six days. And so we're going on an adventure. We got cool shirts that say Kilby with swords, right? Because Kilby's protect and we keep our swords sheathed until we're ready to use them and that's a metaphor. Show the back of the shirt. What does it say? I am love, kind, bold, joyful, honest, serving, growing, thankful, intentional, and I would say dangerous, but it's under control. Mom takes all the girls at 10 years old, and dad takes all the boys at 10 years old, and this is my first trip where we go out and we start talking to the kids about what it means to be a man or a woman. We set up hug stations, dude. All right. Let me see what I'm missing. Got some bad drugs here, slash salt. And maybe I should take some uh, electrolytes. For the weekend. I, I can't. Is four enough? How many days are we gonna be gone? Four. Yeah, perfect, that's enough. It's like, I, this is my treat, some stevia. Yes. Live in large. Yeah. Oh, crap. What? I just almost made a missed steak. By not taking your steak? <laughs> bacon. This is some bacon. Sous vide chuck steak. Not sous vide ribeye. Ribeye, ribeye, ribeye. Can I come? <laughs> Some shrimps. <coughs> oh, that person. Then I only have jam. Then I only have jam. And she's gonna be sad that I'm gone. <laughs> Because we've already been on two birthday parties. I have. I want to go on with that nacho picture. When Levi and Jacob are gone, I'm going to go with this one. And here's her bed. Dad. Dad. Alright. Yes. I'm just going to be the most boy. Everyone, go potty. I did. Okay, well, let's roll. Well, Isaac, Mom's not going to be on your birthday trip. I want to. Yeah, you're next, Isaac. You're going with Dad. Love you. Mm -hmm. Mwah. It's weird. I'm kissing the internet. I'm getting rescued <laughs> by Mama. Okay. My, my thing of salt <laughs> that I smoked. Thank you. You're welcome. So I thought I was missing something. Don't want to miss the salt, bro. Oh yeah, I'm also okay. bringing some pork rinds. And there's another one in there, so. I don't snack too much, but if I'm gonna do it, it's gonna be on a road trip. All right, we're going south, y'all. Let's get going south, y'all. Let's go south, y'all. What do you guys wanna listen to? Some gangster rap music? I don't even know. Do you even know what that is? Nope. <laughs> I'll t tell you all about it on this trip. In the heart of the breathtaking Smoky Mountains, where ancient trees whispered tales of grandeur and the winds carried echoes of untold adventures, a father set out on a legendary journey with his twin sons who were about to reach the ripe age of 10. This adventure, though seemingly modest in scale, was destined to become an epic saga that would redefine the very essence of their bonds as father and sons. What? What would you think about this old Tennessee thing? I can't move. Why can't you move? Because my seatbelt won't move. <laughs> Welcome to Tennessee, y'all. Welcome to Tennessee. Yeah, yeah shoot dang everybody. We all on here in Tennessee. That I mean you we only got we got about 85 miles to go. We're gonna get where we go. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We're gonna go check out the world's the world's best bathrooms world's best bathrooms or at least the united states of america or at least tennessee's best bathrooms 
best bathrooms in the whole world. Tennessee's best bathroom. I don't know. I don't get out that much. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We stopped by a Waffle House not too long ago. We had the Waffle House, you know. Got some eggs. And got some sausage. Yeah. Don't get none of those hoe cakes. Sugar britches. <laughs> All right. Are we gonna fit tickets into the bathroom? Rooms over there, and there that far side. Yeah. Do I just take this with me? What, my young squires, the father mused, his voice a blend of excitement and wisdom, makes a man. And how does one instill these virtues in the hearts of young knights like yourselves? His path in life had been a meandering river, a course through turbulent waters, but it had honed him into the sturdy patriarch and father he was now, ready to impart the essence of manhood to his twin charges. A man, he thoughtfully conveyed, was akin to a blade, sharp and noble, yet tempered with the wisdom to remain sheathed until called upon. His mission as a father was nothing short of guiding his twin sons to become blades of discernment, a quest never truly concluded, but forever worth the pursuit. Their adventure, framed by the majestic Smoky Mountains, was a pilgrimage to seek wisdom from nature's heart and ignite a conversation about the burgeoning essence of masculinity. I'm not right for this. I am.
they embarked on a quest through the realms of Pigeon Forge and Gatlinburg, their excitement a torrential river, ready to carve a path through every obstacle. A mirror maze, a riddle for the mind, played tricks on their senses, mirroring the bewildering nature of life's puzzles. Swords gleamed in shop windows, each blade a vessel of storied valor, and the twins, once nonchalant, were captivated by the enchanting call of adventure. With the dawn, they undertook an epic ascent of Chimney Tops Mountain, a four-mile odyssey with a daunting elevation rise of 1,400 feet over a mere two miles. Bridges and vistas unfolded before them, and despite the fatigue that beckoned the indomitable spirit of young knights for bad surrender, they reached the pinnacle, heads held high, true conquerors of nature's majesty. Yeah. That's some of the teenagers that were walking by us. Uh -huh. We're like, yeah. You guys want to give up? I haven't even had a knife in You guys want to keep going or turn back? I can't breathe. I can't say. I can't you want to give up? Or you can go back or make it? So you're going up the mountain? Yeah. You're not going to give up? No, I want to see the view. You want to see the view? I knew you weren't going to give up. It's all right. We can always take a break if we need to. We got that work in earlier, so it's paying off. This is going on the internet. <laughs> We're climbing up this hill. And uh, yeah, I'm pushed me pretty good. I'm sitting here bending over trying to catch my breath and I felt like I had, I'm having a niacin flush in my face. Just like feeling like taking niacin. Whew, my face is on fire bending over like this. <sighs> but it's like I feel like I need it too. Gonna push through? Okay. But they have no idea all how the people watching this video have no idea the pain of climbing up this mountain. Yeah. Unless they have. But here's the thing. They also won't know the reward. Yeah. This is where you say science. Because technically all they have to do is sit on their couch and watch it. No. They don't know. Yeah. You can't outwork a bad diet, but you can walk up a freaking mountain. <laughs> Feel like you're gonna die, but then do it. Science. Literally, we're, can't even see. Literally, we're going up this hill, and there's a guy like 90 years old coming down. I'm like, yep, I'm making this. Have you been defeated, Sir Knight? Knight? I'm. Get on me. I'm gonna go to the tippy top. Yeah. Well, this goes down. Kilby's, uh. Kilby's gonna give up. <laughs> no, Kilby's <laughs> follow these rules. Okay. We at least need to take some pictures. Yeah, we'll go take oh, some pictures. Oh, yeah.
What's up, haircut? Nothing, haircut. I don't care, this is maybe even higher. <laughs> and you're the one who wanted to do it, so. Your feet hanging out is scary. Hopefully, uh, yeah, I'm getting that moment where I'm, I'm afraid of heights. Getting that moment where I'm afraid of falling down. But that's, it'll, it'll pass. <sighs> hey, everybody. It's Aaron from McKilby Live. It's me. With and Levi and Jacob. They're almost 20 years old collectively and route on an adventure the smoky mountains we're headed up to the top of a mountain yeah we're gonna go up here and uh take naps well you've already seen us climb not really natural we're not gonna take naps with our feet but now we're using a ski lift all right let's not enjoy skiing. this <laughs> let's not fall. I'm not jumping. I'm just walking. I'm just walking roughly. No walking roughly. No running. 